surprisingly small group, but let's get into it. Right there. There we go. Okay. The 2010 Barth 500 SS, which costs 35,000 credits, starts at C563, is front wheel drive with an engine at the front as well. It is a is a 5 in speed, a 5.8 in handling, a 6.4 in acceleration, a 6.7 in launch, and a 5.9 in braking. Next is the 2016 Abarth 695 by Posto, which costs 48,000 credits, which is okay. Which has, a, or it starts at B625, is front wheel drive with an engine also at the front. It has a speed. Is a 5 in the speed, a 6.6 in handling, a 6.8 in acceleration, a 6.9 in launch, and a 7.7 in braking. Next is the not hot hatch, hot hatch. The 2002 Acura RSX Type S, which costs 25,000 credits, starts at C568. It has front wheel drive with an engine at the front as well. It has 5.7 in speed, a 5.8 in handling, a 6.6 .6 in acceleration, a 6.7 in launch, and a 5.5 in braking. Next is another not hot hatch, hot hatch. The 2013 Dodge Dart GT, which costs 22,000 credits. So it's cheaper than, you know, like, basically any car that you can actually buy without buying any of the DLC which is quite nice of the creators of this game to do make this car which is probably worth more than some of those cars worth less than it considerably nice of them anyways it starts at C567 is front wheel drive with an engine at the front as well it has a 5.6 in speed, 5.9 in handling, 6.1 in acceleration, 6.1 in launch, and 4.9 in braking. Next is the 2014 Ford Fiesta ST, which costs 25,000 credits. Starts at B604. It's front wheel drive with an engine in the front. It's a 5.4 in speed, a 6.3 in handling, a 6.7 in acceleration, a 6.8 in launch, and a 6.2 in braking. Next is the 2004 Honda Civic Type R, which costs 25,000 credits. It starts at C573. It's front wheel drive with an engine in the front. It's a 5.6 in speed. It's a 5.7 in handling, a 6.9 in acceleration, a 6.6 in launch, and a 5.5 in braking. Next is the 2010 Mazda Mazda Speed 3, which costs 35,000 credits. It has it starts at C599 is front wheel drive on the edge of the front is rear it whoa it has a 5.9 in speed a 6 in handling a 6.9 in acceleration a 6.9 in launch and a 6.1 in braking next is the 2012 mini John Cooper Works GP which costs 38,000 credits it has. It starts at B618. It ha It is front wheel drive with an engine in the front. It has a 5.6 in speed, a 6.1 in handling, a 7.1 in acceleration, a 6.9 in launch, and a 7.1 in braking. Then the 2012 Mini John Cooper Works GP Horizon Edition, which has a skills boost. It starts at A702. It is front wheel drive. It has a speed of 5.6, a handling of 6.8. No, the speed the speed doesn't change. The handling is a nice improvement. The acceleration is 7.2, which is a little improvement. The launch is 7.2, which is also a little improvement. And the braking is an 8.2, which is a considerable improvement. And also, this Horizon Edition car is way too expensive on the auction house as I've seen and I don't know why but good god it's way too expensive and nobody's buying it for that much but of course when somebody puts it at a low price it gets bought out immediately 
So, it's wonderful. It's wonderful. Next, the 2013 Renault Clio RS200, which costs 29,000 credits. Starts at C596. Is front-wheel drive with an engine in the front. A 5.2 in speed, a 6.2 in handling, a 6.6 .6 in acceleration, a 6.9 in launch, and a 6.9 in braking. And finally, the 2016 Vauxhall Corsa VXR, <coughs> which costs 28,000 credits, starts at C589, is front wheel drive with an engine at the front, is a 5.2 in speed, a 6.1 in handling, a 6.6 .6 in acceleration, a 6.7 in launch, and a 6.8 in braking, which relatively comparable stats to, to the Clio. And the Clio looks cooler, so, you know. <laughs> Anyways, uh, that is basically it for the uh, hot hatches, but we are going to look at the stupid prices for the Mini, which there, there, there sometimes is really cheap prices, but most of the time it's just, you know, way too much. So, start bid, 6 million, 7 million, 2 million, that's the highest bid is 2 million. So people are willing to pay 2 million for this thing because it's, they just want it. I guess it's for the skills boost, but still. Like, <sighs> yeah, yep. It's, um, yeah, the lowest is, is two million. It's also the only one with a, b with a bid on it. And if you wanted to buy it out, it could cost you as much as eleven million sixty thousand. <sighs> yeah. yeah. It sucks for the people who want them that, like, there's only, there's only, like, good prices available every once in a, you know, like, like, once every two or three days. And then it's gone to, like, one person, because, you know, there's only, like, one. Wow, you don't need to be seeing that. Anyways, that is it for Hot Hatches, actually. Next time, it's, um, uh, Retro Hot Hatches, which is, you know, <laughs> basically the same. <laughs>